to my channel. I'm Star. My channel's name is Starlight Starbright 70. If you're returning, thank you so much for coming back. And if you are new, come on in. Um, I mostly do diamond painting, diamond painting reviews. Um, I do a few hauls here and there. Um, today I've got four diamond paintings to show you. Um, I also show my completed diamond painting. So I just started this channel, so I'm fairly new. Um, thank you so much if you subscribed and for my new subscribers, thank you so much. Um, YouTube doesn't always notify me of all of them, but uh, the new ones that I have seen um, from yesterday are uh, Shelly, Carol, Silky, Otami, and Angie. So thank you so much for subscribing and I sure do hope you come back. Um, and then again, for those of you that uh, YouTube didn't notify me of, thank you so much for your subscription as well. It means the world to me. So today I've got, uh, like I said, four diamond paintings. They all come from Timu. If you don't know what Timu is, it's an online marketplace that has uh, thousands of sellers, thousands of diamond paintings. <laughs> Let me tell you, thousands of diamond paintings. So yeah. This is the first one I want to show you. It's a 30 by 30. Whoops, my kitty just knocked something over. It's a 30 by 30. Uh, it has 22 colors. It was $3.48. It's my little bunny foo foo sitting in the spring flowers. This painting here would be good for Diamond Grandma's event this month. Just all petals 24. I believe Diamond Zotita is also having one. Of, um, hers, I think, is green. So you could probably use this picture for that as well. Or this painting. Um, I will link their description. Or I will link their channels in my description. So uh, go check them out. As well as uh, I'll put them up here somewhere on my screen. Yes, yeah, so that's little bunny foo foo. So cute. Um, this one's all rambled with symbols and letters. Yeah. Little flowers. It's so, so cute. Really, really good draw fill, as you can see. No issues there. Um, this is the color palette that it came with. So you got your purples, greens, yellows. Peaches, some grays. So, yeah, really, really nice. Sticking this to this one is probably really good. Yeah, no issues with being sticky. And each of your paintings is going to come in these little, there, I have gotten four. So, this is a I'll only show this one. It, uh, so it comes with your own little tray. It comes with some wax. And it comes with a pen. This is all you need to start. Um, but the this tray can get frustrating. Because when you're shaking them. The diamonds can spill out. It, I mean it, it is kind of flimsy. If you go on, if you go on uh, Timu. And you just put in. Um, search for uh, diamond painting trays you'll see a bunch that come up um, I don't have one available here that I use but uh, I use like a bigger white one that's more sturdy than this and uh, as well as as you see these bags here they come in these little bags that you have to cut open so um, I suggest to buy a little storage container so if you just put storage container for diamond painting you'll see a bunch that come up you can get some that are like 88 cents that's all you need so i i do suggest those two things if you're if you're just wanting to start out it's not going to cost you it's going to be probably all under uh five six dollars um, if you get a painting this size like i said this was 348 so then maybe you had another dollar uh, for your uh, tray and then another another dollar for your uh, container so but yeah I look forward to starting on her she's gonna be she that little bunny's gonna be really really cute 
So the next one I got, this one was on a lightning deal. Absolutely beautiful. I'm part Native American. My father uh, was, is Native. I'm not sure if he's still alive. <laughs> I was adopted, so I never did meet him. But, but yeah, that's the only information I really got was uh, what my mother was, which she was Scottish, and then my father it was Native American. So they actually just, just put on their Indian <laughs> back in the 70s. But yeah, it's a really, really nice. You got an eagle, you got your wolf. She's holding a, a little uh, pup. You got your teepees back here, and you got an elder here. Um, when you when you get this painting, if you do get this painting, uh, it's kind of blurred. It looks really nice, actually on camera. Quite impressed. Um, but hopefully when it's done, the, some of the details will come out. I'm not sure if his face is going to come out or her face. You might be able to see some of the eyes, but I think everything else will be okay. Here too, I don't think you're going to see much of his face. On these smaller paintings, this is a 30 by 40. Not all the details do come out, but but that's okay. Like I said, for $1.98, it is uh, $3.14 right now. So that's still a good price for a uh, 30 by 40. <clears throat> does come with 25 colors, 1 through 8, and then 8 to X. But yeah, uh, it does have dummy circles on it, or training circles, or whatever you want to call it. I don't mind them. I actually like them. I I can follow pretty nice. The, the diamond's going so nice and straight, at least to me. I, I'm going to say that these paintings are good. If you have OCD and you're, you know, everything, all your diamonds have to line up with these uh, circles here. <laughs> helps with that. Let me just say that. I do struggle with that, uh, unfortunately. But I do love diamond painting, so. I pray a lot and I, and I overcome a lot, so. <laughs> yeah. Well, at first I was like spending, I would spend at least a half an hour in just a little uh, section, getting it all straight. And then I would start on my next section and then have to go back to that one because some of these diamonds push those over. It was just, uh, yeah, but uh, I'm good. I'm kind of good now. So <laughs> it was a struggle for me. But yeah, really, really nice. So I hope everyone's having a wonderful, wonderful day today. If you got any plans, let me know that you got planned. Hopefully this afternoon I can get out there and enjoy some of the desert weather we're having. Hopefully the wind doesn't pick up. Usually by afternoon the wind picks up here and uh, it's it's over. That dust flying everywhere. But uh, But yeah, so this is the color palette. And like I said, the stickiness was really good on that one. So yeah, this is the color palette of this one. Darker colors. You do have some lighter colors here. I don't know if you can see that. There you go. They're really, really nice. So looking forward to that one. I'll probably, I have a book that I store these paintings in, so I usually put my diamonds in a different container and then I uh, store the 30 by 40s and <clears throat> smaller in a book that I have so that, so they get all nice and, and flat. So my next one here, she's so cute. It's a little fairy girl. She's got a little pouting, beautiful blue eyes. She's got a butterfly in her hair and she's got a butterfly down here. She's holding flowers. She's got a wolf sitting beside her and a baby wolf. Uh, we actually had a husky that looked much like this one. So she was $3.98. She's a 30 by 40. She has 19 colors. Uh, one through eight and A to R all nicely in order. Wonderful. Really nice clear drill fill as well if you can see that. Really, really nice. So she'll be no problem. She does have a little bit of darker areas. 
I think there's going to be a lot of grays, but easy, easy to see. She too has the, uh, some, some of them anyway, not all of them, but some of them do have the training circles on the, on here. But, and let's see, she's probably going to be nice. Yeah, she's nice and sticky. Very, very nice. And this is her color palette. So you can imagine it's going to be all the darker colors. The browns. Got some blues in there for her wings and for the butterflies. There'll probably be some a bit of pinks in here. Light pink, probably. In there. So yeah, those are her colors. I think she's going to turn out really, really cute. And then last but not least is my big fairy girl. <laughs> she kind of reminds me of an anime fairy. Um, if you've watched my other videos, you, um, I have mentioned that I have played uh, World of Warcraft. But I also got into... Uh, a game called Final Fantasy that I played for quite a long time. Um, you can create your own little characters. And I was into the crafting part <laughs> of any game, even World of Warcraft. Uh, I was into into making things. I got to I got to go farm and uh, and then I got to make things. So that was my thing in the game. So I was always the crafter. So if you needed anything, you'd come see me. Chances are I'd be able to make it for you. It was a lot of fun. So yeah, so here's the fairy. She's uh, sitting in the trees. It just looks like there's a castle behind her. Uh, when I looked on this one, it said uh, something about witch and Halloween. I don't see it, but maybe she's a fairy witch. I'm not sure. I just love the color purple and how she was like standing out in the picture. Just to me, it was just absolutely gorgeous. Uh, she was ten dollars and ninety-eight cents, and forty by seventy. We'll check her stickiness. Oh yeah, nice and sticky. No, no issues there. And then these are the. Let's see, get you the right side here. So these ones come all kitted up, which is nice. So that means that they're all, all in their individual baggies. So you could start on this uh, right away if you wanted to. Yeah, look at those purples. So, so, so nice. It's gorgeous. So yeah, so those are my four paintings that I got. Um, if you don't know what Timu is, like I said, I'm going to leave a link and... Uh, a promo code for you to use for your 30% off and your $100 discount. Um, I was leery too when I first started uh, purchasing off of Timu. Uh, but I've had no complaints at all. Um, no complaints with their diamond paintings. The prices are amazing. I think they're, they're more or less, I think, the cheapest that I've seen um, for their prices. There might be some other budget companies out there with around the same prices. I'm not sure. Um, I haven't ordered, like I said, from any other company. Um, mo almost all my diamond paintings have come from Timu. So um, if they haven't, then it was a, it was Amazon because there was a certain one I was looking for for my daughter for Christmas to make her. But uh, but yeah, so I just want to leave you with just a little saying. Um, may you always have a sunbeam to warm, to warm you, good luck to charm you, and a sheltering angel so nothing can harm you, laughter to cheer you, faithful friends near you, and whenever you pray, heaven to hear you, and may you feel God's love. So I'm sending much love from my home to yours, and I hope you have a very wonderful day, afternoon, or night, whatever, wherever, or whatever time you're watching this. And may God bless you. Thank you so much for watching. I just want to give a special shout out to a hauler that I have watched uh, basically from the beginning. Her name is Hauler Time. Uh, I'll put the description um, 
I'll link her channel in my description. Uh, she started a new channel regarding uh, doing crafts. I believe she's going to be starting on journaling, uh, but she also diamond paints. Uh, her new channel is Narrowgate88 Creates. I'll put it on the screen and also link her down in the description. So yeah, go check her out.